I view her as um, I view her as white, pretending to be black. I don't really, I've never really viewed her as black. I viewed her as being really interested in African African American studies and trying to help with. Um, of fixing racism and stuff, but I've never really viewed her as actually black. I've always viewed her as white. When you say before that she always considered herself uh, white, how far back do you recall? Because you were adopted when you were 15. And when, she, me, no, when she was 15. When she was 15. So tell me a little bit, when do you remember her first identifying herself as black when you say she did it long? 2011. 2011, definitely. Because in interviews, she claimed that even as early as five years old, mm -hmm. she said she remembers coloring and drawing mm -hmm. pictures of herself. She yeah. could never pick the peach crayon. It had to be the brown crayon drawing yeah, black curly hair as a child. Mm -hmm. Do you remember other instances as a child when she would identify and call herself black? Well, I wasn't I wasn't alive when she was a child, no. but um, growing up, as my parents were saying, it's like there was no signs of her even ever doing that. I mean, those pictures that she said she drew, I mean, I've those I'm, those are actually not. I'm pretty sure not real because I um, this has only now recently been. Oh, now all of a sudden she's she drew the stuff when she was five. I mean, I'm pretty sure they, they would have been lying around or my parents would have had them and they never did. So hey, YouTube fans! I'm Luke Russert. Thanks for checking out our MSNBC channel. Subscribe by clicking right here and click any of the videos over here to watch the latest breaking news, mini documentaries, conversations from Shift, and other digital exclusives. Check it out.